Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Tell Me Why episode 3, part number 3. Now, welcome back. Anyways, uh, thank you guys again for the support on the last series. My apologies, it was long. I had to add some parts to it at the end. If no one didn't realize, I added some parts at the end. Ladies and gentlemen, like I said, welcome back to Tell Me Why. A game that is a pretty interesting game, I should say. And the same creators that made the, what is it, Life is Strange Part 1 and Part 2, I think they made Part 2 as well. And some other games off their, like, Choices games. This is a really interesting game to me. And, like I say, thank you guys again for the support off of this, uh, off of this series. And let's get back right into it. Last time, uh, there was a secret between, uh, Tyler. Tyler is called Ollie. And the mother got mad. Because Tyler cut his hair because Allison cut his hair. And uh, apparently we figured out Tyler's secret. And we had these memories kind of thing. Um, like I said. But also I got some really good news. I'm going to be bringing some Ghost of Tsushima. I just got back right into the part. Like I said, I had to do a lot of things with Ghost of Tsushima. Like I said, I'm really excited to get back into Ghost of Tsushima as well, so definitely stay tuned to that. Like I said, guys, uh, let's go ahead and get started right into it. Uh, let me see the chapters really quick. Got collectibles and crafty goblins. Okay. So, uh, let's uh, continue. Apparently, we're going to be finding the mothers. Mary Ann is the mother of the two, so most likely they grew up with each other or something like that. Who knows? Like I said, welcome back. So, Tess may have answers. So this is where we kind of left off. Uh, let's do... I'll do that one. What about Tessa? She was Marianne's closest friend. Let's ask her about it. Sure. But I'll warn you, she's particularly touchy about this subject. Well, maybe she'll talk to me. I was always her favorite. Operative word, was. But... We need to go by the store anyway, to get a few things for the repairs. Great. Two seagulls, one stale hunk of bread. I'm not sure I like that analogy. Listen, I know you don't want to keep talking about this. But you're obviously not going to be satisfied until we do. Damn. So let's talk. Mm, we'll do this one. We did that one. You've been on edge all day. Is there something more going like on said, with you? It's nothing. That long. Pretty sure it's not nothing. And I'd like us to be on the same to page. To I thought we were on the same page. Sell this place as quick as possible and move on. Right. Look, I've already explained why this is so important to me. Why are you still dragging your feet? It's just, just with the, the way you avoided that. this place for the last three years, I thought you wouldn't want to spend any extra time here. Oh. So that's what this is about. Maybe a little... Yeah. Eventually. It's just... You graduated three years ago. And this is the first time we've seen each other in person. This is a redo, redo what happened last time. Uh, wasn't ready to come back. Couldn't find the time. Wasn't ready to come back. It's not that I didn't want to see you. Excuse me. I just... Wasn't ready to be Tyler in Delos Crossing. I tried to visit you. I tried to go to your fireweed graduation. I wanted to bake you a crappy boxed cake and take awkwardly posed photos. I know. But you shut me out. All I got was non-responses and half-assed evasions. Look, I didn't want to see oh, anyone. I just started thing. testosterone and I feel oh, like I'm cursed God. when I do that. I had the worst oh, no. acne. Just... My emotions were all over the place, and the smells... Allison, the smells... Men smell bad. I know. I've dated a few. Look, I needed some time to figure my shit out before I asked That's anyone else to try. Oh, yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah, it does. Alright, uh, why rush this house sale? So, I was thinking... Hmm? Do we need to be in such a rush to sell this place? We've been over this. 
and we both agreed it's time for a clean break. Like I know, trust me. I'm not talking about staying for long, just long enough to get some answers. And you think this house has those answers? Mostly. Maybe not, but it's a place to start. That's true. Well, there, is this like a, part, a place to it start It would be a shame all. if That's there was something to really find, good, uh, and we tossed it out. How about... We start digging without putting Future off the wise, sale. Get a new, uh, and if it seems like we need more time, light. we'll talk about it then. Okay. Really not helping. I miss my old light, actually. Uh, I'll go ahead and we have a plan. So, we have a plan? Yep. We ask around about Marianne, but we also stick to our repair schedule. If that's really what you need. All right. Deal. All right, here we go. Awesome. Ollie's diary. It's been a long time since I heard oh, that I name. Read this again. Was I the only one who ever called you that? Actually, no. I used it at Fireweed for a while, until I settled on Tyler. Most people were pretty chill about the switch. Not everyone, though. What do you mean? I had a mentee who refused to call me Tyler. He didn't want my help. He didn't want anyone's help. I'm sorry. I, I really don't. I really don't want to. I like there. the name Tyler, by the way. Thanks. I like the name Ollie. Believe it or not, I actually like the name Ollie. Uh, I don't want to read this again because apparently I already read this. I already read all this. So let me go ahead and turn to the next page. Um, what I can, what I can do is I'm gonna zoom it in like I do with everything I read. So I'm gonna go ahead and read it. So, oh, uh, wow. Oh, okay. All right, here we go. Saw Star Wars. Saw Star Wars yesterday at Bobby's place. Luke was so great, but my mom found out we are watching it, and I got so mad. She said it glory, gloried war zoom zamba. Saturday five five. The 5th of February 2005 would mom be happier if I could do what she want me to do when she looked at me she just she just doesn't see me I wish I could show her I wish I could wish I could make her understand I think she doesn't want to Allison told me again that it was my fault mom got angry at us she is a s such a suck up mom barely said anything to us a few days Allie said she saw her throw throwing half a pages away from the book of goblins uh three february oh Hold on. January, February, March. March 1st, 2005. Do this, do that. I'm sick of her voice and I'm sick of that dumb name too. I'm all Ollie the Goblin. Alright. Is there any more? No? That's it? Wow. That was a short diary. Not a bad view, right? I forgot how beautiful it is. That time we tried to cross, we live in our own world. Uh, do that one. We were in our own world most of the time. The lake wasn't just a lake. It was Moonhag's lair, and the mountain was an ice troll. Very, very True. Beautiful. Plus, you get used to anything if you see it every day. Not always. I think I'd like to end up somewhere like this, just not here. Somewhere with more trees than people? You know, I always exactly. thought this would be cabin Just go into it with a little more of a plan than Marianne did. You have, like, a cabin, a house, or something like that. Uh, she did have a plan. I could be a ranger. I could be a ranger. Already working on it. With my degree, it'll be easy to get a job as a ranger. After you spend a little time in Juno? Uh, still a maybe on that one. Uh, so we're gonna talk to Allison. What's that over there? If you squint... You could almost forget Delos Crossing's only a few miles away. I'm sure Marianne tried to. Can't blame her. We're headed there for supplies later. You ready for that? Yeah, but I was really enjoying a day without assholes. 
Just a little longer, and every day will be asshole free. That might be asking a lot. <laughs> asshole free. I love it. Let's talk to. Uh, I guess we could talk to her again, right? Nice ring. Get from your boyfriend? Come on. I told you I'm not with anyone right now. Don't rub it in. <laughs> Why does it look familiar? It was a gift from Eddie. He had them both made at the same time. Both? Oh, wait. Yeah. This ring is supposed to be linked to the one he gave you, in a spiritual way. Do you believe in all that? You mean, do I believe we could be linked in some other metaphysical way? You know, other than the one that already lets us share thoughts and memories. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, Alright. I think that's enough time enjoying the view. I wasn't gonna say anything, but... Yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> I was the one all eager to go, and then I started waxing poetic about the landscape. Go ahead. I'll catch up. Need to respond to a message. Uh huh. My sister, the social butterfly. So they are brother and sister. Okay, that makes sense. Wonder if you get to play as her. Again. Seems we got a trespasser. <laughs> what oh, the fuck? Fuck. You got five seconds to Who talk me into defending my property. Your property? Five. Four. I'm Tyler. Don't know any Tylers. Three. Two. Sam! Ellie? <laughs> what are you doing out here, girl? This is our house. Was I talking to you? Sam, put the gun down. This is Tyler. Yes. My yeah. brother. Brother. Well, your brother? Oh, shit. Huh. I guess I heard about all that, but I never. Sam. <laughs> You look like a real man. So do you, Sam. You know what I mean. I just didn't know they could make a woman look so much like a man. Damn. Fuck. I'm just a man. I'm just me. That one. That's so assaulting, man. You know, I'm just trying to be me. It's just who I am. Hmm. Well, I've seen a couple of lady transvestites on the TV before, but, uh, I've never seen a dude. Sam, that's not how you say that. Say what? Transvestites? Yes. It's transgender. Transgender men. Ah, uh, I'm sorry. It's hard to keep track out here in mm -hmm. Delos Crossing. <laughs> the world's just moving on without okay, us. Sam, whatever you say. It's Rude. fine. Let's just change the subject. <laughs> Works for me. Tyler. Thanks, Sam. Oh, I thought that was mine. It's like an airplane going by. So, what are you doing here exactly? Oh, well, I, uh, I've been kind of keeping an eye on this place for you, you know? Like patching the roof, checking the pipes, and all that stuff. Thank you, Sam. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's, uh, that's no big deal. I just, you know, your mama, she was, uh, she was a special lady. She deserved much better than, you know, uh, what you got. Didn't you used to help Mary Ann with repairs and building projects? Oh, yeah. Yeah, seeing as your mama never had a man around, I just you know, took it on myself to help her keep this place standing. Hmm. How antiquated of you. Thanks. I uh, guess you two are still aiming to sell the place? That's the plan. Which, by the way, we need your keys. Since apparently you went and changed the locks? Oh yeah, absolutely. But, uh, <laughs> selling your mother's house? Are you sure? Yes. Bad or good? It's all you've got left of her. In your childhood. I'll admit it. No one asks you bad memories, too. A few bad memories, too. It's kind of not his business. A few bad memories, too. Good or bad, it's all that you got left of her. See that. Funny. Don't remember asking for your opinion on the subject. Tyler! What? <laughs> it's kind 
has been What Tyler done. means is, a fresh start is what we both need. Of course. Yeah. Yeah, I, I would have let her answer it. I would. This place has got to be full of all kinds of bad memories. How would you know? But maybe some good ones, too? Yeah, well, they're kids when they grew up and all that. Uh, hold to speak to you. Wait, wait, wait. Hold to speak using your voice. to go it's time to go we should get going that's all you think we'll get out of him he's too wasted to be of any more help <laughs> I'll tell him to get a move on then thank you okay. well We've got a supply mind. run to make, and Uncle Eddie's expecting a visit, so... Oh, right. Yeah, of course. Uh, get going, you two. Um, Sam? We all gotta get going. Oh. Uh, of course. <laughs> of course, yeah, I got lots to do myself. I, lots of to-dos on old Sam's list. And you don't want to keep Brown waiting, you know? <laughs> Thanks for looking out for this place. Happy to do it. I... I don't know this guy. Uh, He's, he seems sketchy. Don't hesitate to reach out if you need anything. Anything at all. You hear? He seems sketchy. Even though he's friends with the mother, but he seems very, Sam? very sketchy. Huh? Uh, Sam? Huh? The keys? Oh, yeah. Of course. Yeah, the, of course. the keys. Of course. They're Sam. yours. I, uh... Mm. This place, it meant a lot to your mother. It almost felt like it was a part of her, and, and it's like some part of her is alive here still. Hopefully the house doesn't turn out to be a murderous psycho that tries to kill us in our sleep, huh? Uh, yeah. Well, uh, yeah, take care of yourself. Uh, he seems sketchy. Both of you. I'm not gonna lie, he seems very, very sketchy. Hey, so, we really do have a lot to do. Okay, go on. I'll be right behind you. I wonder if you get to play as Allison again, because in the first one, you played as her, like, in the beginning. I wonder if you can play as both of them, or is it only just Tyler? I heard there's more chapters coming out of uh, this, this month, actually. Which is really exciting. Chapter 2 and Chapter 3. Like what I heard. I'm not too sure when it will be out, though. I know it, I know it's this month. That's all I know. I know it's this month. Really excited for these kind of chapters to come out. Like I said, this is chapter one, so this is like the beginning of like a new start or something that's happening, basically. I mean, yes, it is the full game. It's just like this is the first chapter out of like their life. You get to meet these characters and all. So, uh, off to town we go! Yay! Love it. Like I said, guys, I'm gonna try my best to schedule videos as possible for you guys. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Go straight into town. This is one easy to play, I guess, right? Usually. I only needed it only because of, like, copyrights. Ready to Veni Vidi Vecchi? I'm ready to talk to Tessa. Okay. So we're gonna talk to Tessa before we do anything else. She said we need to get Just groceries and all that. Try to keep stuff. in mind that your memory of her is ten years out of date. Yeah, well, it wouldn't be if she reached out to me while I was in That's fire cool, place, which she um, didn't. Takes place in Alaska. I've never been Alaska. So I'm guessing this is Michael? We're playing as Allison. Look at that. Like I said from the beginning. What do you want, brother? What do you want? I'm guessing he's the youngest and she's the oldest. Hey, you. Hey. 
Isn't it your day off? Miguel. Yep, we're here as patrons. Tyler, meet Michael. This is the Michael. annoying coworker I was telling you about. I was there for your introduction to marshmallow vodka and wine coolers, and I've only worked my way up to annoying coworker. Rude. <laughs> Don't worry. She told me exactly how miserable she'd be in this town without you. It's so good to finally <laughs> meet you. The Tyler talk goes on 24-7, so I feel like I already know you. <laughs> so, uh, you here to grab some stuff for the homestead, or...? Yeah, we decided it'd be easiest if we just stayed out there. We'll get it cleaned up Let's faster if we literally cannot escape it. <laughs> hey, I'm all for efficiency. Cannot wait for us to get out of here. Nice. What's that? Maybe he's gonna be a roommate he wants to move to. Oh, uh, Michael is moving to Juno too. Oh. And did you guys plan on moving together, or...? Well, I mean, yeah. I don't know him. It'll be cheaper to okay, share a place, I don't, I don't know but nothing's history. set in stone. Makes sense. Them. There could be room for you, too. <laughs> for sure. The more Ronins, the merrier. Right, I'm studying to be a chef, so, uh, you know it'll be good eating. And hey, I only snore during allergy season. And baseball. <laughs> How can I say no to that? <laughs> <sighs> you okay? Dead on my feet, girl. Got up at four to fish before work. It's been a day. Oh, you like to fish? Yeah, there's this spot called Buzzard Hole I go to at least twice a week. It's like an hour drive, but it's so chill, especially first thing in the morning. Shut up. I used to go there all the time. For real? Yeah. Hey, well, if you want to go sometime, holler at me. I don't mind sharing. Cool. Most guys I know get all Smeagol about their fishing spots. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at you two. Bonding over the most slow and boring way to kill an animal. She's just jealous because she couldn't catch a fish. Even if she filled the lake with cyanide I'm first. Not that too. Never mind. Tyler, we better get started with our shopping. Yeah, I'll be around if you need anything. Should we go inside, or stand around until we become human popsicles? Remember. Well? I want to have the crispy tocino! And noodles and spring rolls! And yeah, can we get the coconut cake for dessert? Easy, easy, my hungry goblins. We have to leave some food for the other customers. But Auntie Tessa said we can have whatever we want! Man, I miss Tessa's cooking. She still make those, what are they called, fried banana rolls? Tehran? Right. Mm, no, I'm pretty sure she made them special for us. Hey, Ollie! Look, I'm the ruler of this kingdom. Wow. Get it? Because it's a dome, <laughs> you're gonna fall, stupid. That was funny. I can't believe you didn't laugh. That was hilarious. Not as funny as you getting all pouty when I didn't laugh at your jokes. I love baiting you. It was my favorite thing. We're gonna go there, but we're just gonna look around for a second here. <laughs> Tessa tried to spirit that sign away a couple years ago, but Tom put it back. He loves that cheesy slogan. Veni BD. Oh, I just got it. That's kind of funny, actually. It's been up here for ages. Excuse me for not being hip to Julius Caesar at 11. Also, I was probably too busy dodging your snowballs to notice. <laughs> Don't tempt me. Tessa's still doing that Bible study here every Wednesday? Mm-hmm. Wednesday nights are always packed. She cooks tons of bibinka and the Hail Marys start flowing. <laughs> There's gonna be a lot of leftovers after the rapture. More for us? Come on, I'm freezing here. Hold on, I really hope they get enough signatures on this. On what? They want to build a fancy hunting lodge up the river. It's gonna totally screw up salmon migration. Crazy that they haven't caught him yet. Alert recently have multiple 
school accidents on the of the of mail of theft or crimes in round vehicle crossing. Residents have been reporting letters and packages stolen from mailboxes. Apparently, Should we go inside or stand around Tyler, until we become human popsicles? East of Modern Section Crossing Road Department encourages all residents to increase awareness and corner purchase lock malls boxes. Please report any suspicious activity mentally if you have any more information positive suspects call chief brown as that number do not call that number though it's just a game guys it's just a game all right we're going inside keep your bitches front well hello miss ronan did you forget something in the office no just doing some shopping you remember my brother, Tyler? Your brother? Oh! <laughs> hey, Tyler! What a pleasant surprise. Didn't Allison tell you I'd be by today? Yes, I think she did. I just didn't expect to see such a dapper young man. I guess that was Tom. <laughs> well, I did shower this morning. <laughs> did you just get back into town, or...? More or less. We've been working out at the old house. But, surprise, surprise, after ten years of sitting empty, it was missing a few things. Hence the supply run. Ah, right. Well, we'll get you set right up. It must be nice to be home. Uh, I'm not sure nice is the word for it. Oh, of course. I assume being there feels... complicated. That's one way to describe it. Well, don't let me keep you any longer. I'll be here if you need anything. Oh, hey, is Tessa around today? Um, the wife's not in at the moment. I'm sure she'll be around later, though. Okay. Okay, so we need candles and an all-purpose cleaner. Plus snacks and drinks. I'm starving. Flags. Oh, those are cool. It's like a little fish market. I'm no way. The Trout King is still here. What's this? Michael, you want me to pick up some birch syrup for you? Is that some roundabout way of asking me to make you two my world famous pancakes? Ooh, busted. Let's see. Fresh cut peonies, triple layer chocolate chip cake, toasted marshmallow. Are you doing a dramatic reading of a fancy ass cookbook? Nope, just prep. Mm. Plain candles are fine. Damn it, those are plain candles. Hey Tyler, candy or chips? You know I got a sweet tooth, sis. Candy! Sugar rush it is. Candy, obviously. Alright, so I got two things. Hey Tyler, remember the Trout King? Yeah, I saw it. I thought Tom might have retired him by now. Are you kidding? He never misses a chance to tell customers he won a trout derby. Oh my it God. was a 12 pounder. What does it even look that heavy? This is all the fishing equipment. Inventory, huh? Uh, yeah. My mind is so numb right now. Anyway, how's the shopping spree going? Finding everything you need? I don't know who arranged all the shelves today, but they're a total mess. Are you coming for me, Ronan? Do I have to remind you of the great spreadsheet disaster of 2014, huh? We don't talk about that. I just made one tiny function mistake. Which wound up in the store almost ordering $10,000 worth of tampons. <laughs> you oh. really saved my ass when you caught that. Yep, and you still owe me for it. Ouch. Anyway, how's your day going? We, uh, we found some stuff in Marianne's room that 
really threw us for a loop. Do you want to talk about it? I do, but not here. And I think it also might not be my story to tell. But maybe all of us can hang out later and you can get the whole messy story. All right. Well, I'll be here if you need me. Okay, cool. What else do we need? Any opinion on cleaning products? Only that using them is an unfortunate way to spend an afternoon. I'll take the strong one. Stick it in your back pocket. Look, all the good fishing spots are marked. I don't have my phone on me. And you know you could just Google all this later, right? Are you kidding, Allison? Old fishermen aren't going to share this kind of juicy intel on the internet. I can't. So, uh, what kind of lure would you use for a steelhead? Well, it's hard to beat little Cleos, but depends on conditions. Wait, is this a pop quiz? <laughs> hey, I had to be sure. What? You Fish. think I'm, like, catfishing you? Food. Well, can you blame me for being skeptical of an outdoorsy Rona? We have hmm. no. shrimp. No, I cannot. What else do we have? Ice cream. All soda. Tyler, great. you want water, soda, juice? Whatever you want. I'm not picky. Wish any of it sounded good. That pumpkin's huge. That's orange, right? OJ sound good to you? Yep. Just okay, one? I think we're done here. Tom take will ring us one? up at the counter. Isn't there like two of you guys? Why take one? None. Can you believe Tessa and Tom were ever young? I heard that. Allison, <laughs> I may have a little less going on in the hair department, but you should see the rest of Delos High, class of 81. Fair enough. <laughs> Funny. That's okay. Will that be all? Yes. Thank you, Tom. Oh, hi, Tessa. We were just meaning to come talk to you. Hi, Tessa. Long time no see. My god, you look like a completely different person. It's me. Plus beard. Yes. Hi, Tessa. So we were out at the old house today. Heavens, why would you go there? Surprised it's even still standing. We found some stuff in Mary Ann's room that took us by surprise. Oh, really? We want to ask you some questions about her. You're the only person who might have known Marianne better than us. I, I don't know about that. It's been a decade, kids. I know, but I need to ask. What is it? Did she ever talk about me being a boy? No. It never came up. I found out much later, just like everybody else. Marianne was obviously concerned. She really didn't confide in you at all? Your mother was intensely private. She didn't need anyone else, and she made that clear. But this was about Tyler. She was always willing to ask for help when it came to us. Not at the end. Look, I have a lot on my plate today. I'm sorry. My advice to you would be to try to move on. It's not that easy. <sighs> what happened that night? You can't understand something like that, but it was God's plan. That's all we can know. I need to go now. Best of luck to you, truly. What the hell was that? I told you she wouldn't talk. It's like she's got CIA training. Yeah. Something's weird here. It's weird, right? Yeah, I feel it too. It's like something's on the tip of my tongue. Memories. Tyler? Tyler? Tyler, where are you going? Tyler? Hey. Okay. You're too. Tyler? 
Oh, it's right here. Hey guys, you all done yet? Yeah, Mom. Can we go outside while you and Tessa play cards? I'm afraid there's no time for games today, sweetie. Now let's go. Marianne, can you come here? Sorry, Tessa, I'm in a bit of a hurry. Oh? What's your excuse this time? Emergency repairs for the Nothing beaver normal, dam. Just Tessa, um... look. No, I don't want to hear it. I want to talk to you now. Or do I need to start calling in your debts? Oh. Huh. I'd completely forgotten about that. I remember it, but not exactly like that. Here, let's see if we can call up my version, okay? Oh, fuck, she's in there. Uh, Mom, can we go outside while you and Tessa play cards? No, there's no time for games today. Marianne, can we talk? No, we can't. Just leave the groceries, kids. Let's go. Don't. Please, let's just talk for a few minutes. Okay? Okay. We remember that slightly differently. I guess that makes sense. Rashomon, you know? But whatever happened, after that, they walked to the counter, and then Marianne lashed out at Tessa, right? Uh, no. Marianne defended I us wanted because to Tessa got all preachy. Which is it going to be? She's awesome. I want to talk to you now. Or do I? Please, I let's just talk for a few minutes, okay? You hearing this? Marianne yes. was looking for a fight. Need to start calling in your debts. No, Tessa was. She's Allison, she went on Jack Thompson on Tess her. Was angry at it I, I want to talk to you now. Or do I need to start calling in your debts? That one. The Lord disciplines those he loves. You're failing these kids, Marianne. Judge me all you want, but don't spew that hate around my children. Spew hate? I am trying to be your friend. They need a firm, <laughs> guiding hand, and you, my God. You actually think you're being a friend right now? Talking about my children that way? Yes, you might find this hard to believe, wow. but friends aren't just for loans, Marianne. You really want to get into this? Fine. Let's go to your office. I'll be right back, kids. You stay inside, okay? What is wrong with you? I wish you would have trusted me on this. I really don't think Tessa was being that harsh. You don't know her. And regardless of who started things, once they were in the office, they both went at it. What do you think they were arguing about? Me? Don't know. It was impossible to hear over the music. But hey, now that we know she was lying to our faces, let's ask her. Is there something I can do for you? Uh, you fight with Marianne? Just shopping? You can tell the truth. Earlier you said Marianne kept everything to herself. But you two had a big fight a few months before her death, didn't you? We argued all the time. You'll have to be more specific. This wasn't about who cheated at Canasta. This was intense. You locked yourselves in the office so we couldn't hear. I'm sorry. It was a long time ago. Now, was I was in the middle of something. Sweetheart. Okay. We'll leave you to it. Damn it. I think she knows more than she's letting on. <sighs> uh, duh. But there's no way to nail her down when we don't even know what we mean. If we could pinpoint what it was about, she'd be out of excuses. Sure, but how do we do that? The music was too loud to make out what they were saying. Mm. Marianne and Tessa were obsessed with that song. It was on all the time. What are you thinking? We've been getting these visions whenever we see or hear something really emotional. 
Maybe listening to it will trigger something. Hmm. You may be onto something here, Ronan. We can't go back to her with anything half-assed. We should go talk to Tom. Make sure we build as strong of a case as possible. Okay. Let's see if we can figure out what song it was. Interested. Um... Hey, Tom. There's something I can help you with? How's business? How's business? Oh, a little light on customers, but that's given us time to finish up the inventory. I think we might close early. Maybe catch the final of Survival on Ice live. Uh, don't tell Tessa, but I'm rooting for Butch. She thinks he's too cutthroat. I say that's the game. You tried that new chocolate bar we got in last week? Oh, no. Not yet. I didn't think I'd like it. Habanero and chocolate. Ew. But it's not bad. What do they think up next, huh? What's next on the campaign trail? A rally down at the harbor. The fishermen are getting pretty fed up with business as usual. I've got some ideas about how to keep the fish populations up, but also put food on the table. Grab some flyers. Help spread the word. This might be a weird question, but do you remember the song that Tessa and Marianne used to love? They played it all the time. <laughs> How could I forget? Uh, I think she's still got the CD back here. A little worse for the wear, of course. Uh, hold on. Uh, here it is. I was happy when it got put away, to be honest. A bit cheesy for my tastes. Oh, so he's playing it. I thought we're gonna have it. Couldn't really. This obviously. This is it, right? I think so. They're playing. They're playing the song because you know it's copyright. <laughs> Whoa, I just got hit with a flood of memories. You seeing what I'm seeing? Yeah. yeah. All right, look through these memories. Should we, we check this one out? That's so embarrassing! <laughs> oh, yeah? Tessa, come join me. I know you love this song. No, oh, I couldn't possibly. Some of us are actually trying to get work done here. I forgot how carefree she could be. Yeah. What the hell happened? You think there's more memories lurking around? I don't know. Let's see. The kids keep pestering me for these candies, but they're so expensive. Oh, just grab a bag. It's fine. Oh, no. I, I can't, Tessa. It's nothing. Okay. But write it down in your little notebook. Okay, okay. Whatever you want. There. Happy? Yes. And I'll be by on Wednesday to help you close. Like I promised. Tessa acted like she was Marianne's mom sometimes. I think you mean Tessa was self-righteous and treated Marianne like a charity case. She was trying to help. We should see if we can find that notebook she was holding. I know Tessa still keeps a bunch of them in here somewhere. Her office. What are you doing here? Uh, I thought you needed help with the store. I needed help two hours ago. Have you been drinking? What? No, I just had a day, okay? I took a pill. I'm fine. Marianne. I said I'm fine. Kids, come on, let's go. Wait, please. I have something for you. Take a look at this when you get home, okay? They can handle this confusion. I've been working with these people for years. They can help. 
What do you think that pamphlet was Tessa gave to Mary Ann? I don't know. I saw it in Mary Ann's room. It had a creepy vibe, but I didn't think much about it. It was bad, though. Like, maybe conversion therapy bad. I'm sorry. Whoa. This is true. I want to know how Mary Ann felt about it. And we need to hit Tessa with some hard proof. That's it. Shouldn't we try to find something about the pamphlet Tessa gave Marianne? Good idea. Go here. What was the organization called? The Alliance Against Other People's Business? Okay. Athletic, graceful, and spirited. Sounds like you. Sorry, I might be movie star handsome, but I can't act for shit. We should see if we can find that notebook she was holding. Yeah. I think they're all piled up in Tessa's office somewhere. Obviously. Uh, Tessa, is it okay if I run a quick Google search? My phone's dead. Sure, but make it quick. I'm going to need the computer. Uh, personal. Virtue Seekers Youth Camp. Wait, uh, what? November is that what she recommended for Tyler? I don't know what to say. Uh, I'm sorry, Tyler. Yeah. Let's see how Tessa explains this one away. When change your parents to the guy of person the same as Here's a newsletter from the Alliance for Traditional Families. Here's a newsletter from the Alliance for Traditional Families. Wow. Yikes. Can I help you, Allison? Oh, uh, no, no thanks. I'm good. I'm just looking for something that I forgot. Should I take the ducky? Can I help you, Allison? Oh, uh, Give no, me no thanks. A I'm good. I'm just looking for something that I forgot. Ah, 2004. Anything interesting? Elijah, June, pay off December dollar for the kid. Uh, let's see. February. Not what we want. No show. It looks like Marianne started flaking on her debt in October 2004. Marianne, Five months before gas that night. I think we've seen enough. Yeah, we've got a good sense of what went down. Plus Let's talk to Tessa. Of the pay off of the head of the store, June. Hundred uh, paid off. Wow. January, no show. December, no show, no returning calls. Yeah. I want the ducky. What's this doing here? It's a collectible! I'm a genius! Alright, we're good. Alright, 
So we gotta figure out what are we waiting for? Let's go talk to Tessa. Not now. I think, I think we've seen enough. Yeah, we've got a good sense of what went down. Let's talk to Tessa. Yeah, she has a point. We're gonna talk to her. We're gonna end it. We're gonna end it off when we go talk to her, guys. I don't want it to be way too long for you guys. Here we go. Is there something I can do for you? So what are you doing there? Oh, just inventory. Guess I'm lucky I had the day off, huh? <laughs> yes, what a lucky coincidence. We're back, with details that should help your memory. Oh, really? Yes, really. We were buying groceries, and then you, you stormed in, threatening to call in debts and demanding that Marianne talk no, to you. Allison, it turned into whoa. an argument. So you guys went into the office and blasted that song you used to dance to all the time. Call in debts. I never. Like I'm some kind of load shark. When did this supposedly occur? Well, our memories don't exactly have time stamps. <laughs> I can't be expected to take these accusations seriously if you can't even recall basic details. Damn, she's a bitch. Fuck. Um, that was in October. April. It was April. April 2004. Isn't that when she stopped trying to pay off her debts? Mm-mm. No, that doesn't sound right. I'm sure we never ah. fought about money, though. I was always forgiving with your mother. I could see how she was struggling. Yeah, and you loved lording it over her, didn't you? Allison. Excuse me? Young lady, I help others because it's the right thing to do. You all would have starved if it weren't for me. And we're grateful for that. It's just an emotional subject for us, right, Allison? Yeah. I never said you two were arguing about money. Oh, shit. You were mad she bailed on you. You told her about the camp. She said she'd fallen for us. Remember the day she was supposed to help you get ready for Bible study? And she showed up hours late and totally wasted? Was that it? I really have no idea what you're talking about, and I was never cruel to Marianne. Oh, I did shit. everything I could to help her, to help you all. Even when she fought me, even when she screamed and spit in my face for the effort, even when she, even when she didn't deserve it. What the hell is that supposed to mean? Calm down. Look, we know you took care of us, and we're grateful, but... I really need you to answer one question. When you two fought, was it ever about me? It was always about a lot of things. She was struggling with everything at the end. Did you try to convince Marianne to send Tyler to some kind of program? No, and I yes. think you should go now. Tessa, I'm here to figure out if Marianne tried to kill me because of who I am. Do you get that? I do, I just... Then why won't you give us a straight answer? <laughs> I truly don't know what went on in her mind that day. And it will always be my deepest regret that I didn't see it coming. Now I understand that this is an emotional topic for you both. And fortunately for you, I keep forgiveness at the heart of my relationships. If you're so fucking righteous, why did you dump Marianne when she was at her worst? I will not be dragged back into this. You need to go, now. Can we have our groceries? Ah, uh, um, Michael already put them in your trunk. Cool. Bye, Tom. What are you thinking? Just trying to wrap my brain around all that. You know, we might have actually gotten to the truth if you hadn't lashed out at her. Are you serious right now? You were on her case the whole time. Don't turn this on me! It's obvious she's guilty of something, and that's why she doesn't want to talk about it. Ugh, that sanctimonious bitch! Done now? You get all that out of your system? <sighs> Sorry, I got so worked up. It just makes me crazy that she would play dumb like that. She knows how important this is to us. To you. Yeah, but you know you're onto something with the guilt. She didn't want to admit what they thought about, which makes me think it was me. You spooked her with that talk about the program. I think... Marianne really was trying to figure out how to support me before whatever the hell happened that pushed her over the edge. You may be right. Yeah. She stood up for me, Allison. She was still crazy Marianne, but she saw me. I feel lighter. 
like I've been carrying something around for the last 10 years and now it's gone. Why did I screw up? I don't understand. I, I literally screwed that up. Alright, guys. Uh, I'm going to end it off here, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys didn't just leave a like, let me know you guys' thoughts on it. I probably screwed up the investigation of figuring out Tessa would, like, get mad. So, kind of will make the same mistake for the next one. Maybe. Maybe not. You may never know, guys. But thank you guys again for watching. If you guys didn't just leave a like, subscribe to Turn on notifications on if you are an active subscriber out there. Definitely support the help of the channel and like i said it's gonna be a lot of things coming up once again i'm gonna be scheduling my videos so ghost of tsushima is coming back so my people that love ghost of tsushima it is coming back uh, don't worry it is coming back very soon i uh, definitely see you for that uh, more other games coming out i'm trying to bring out a pc game out there pretty soon as well there's gonna be a new scary there's gonna be a scary game coming out on a friday not this coming up friday probably around next friday I'm really excited for that to come out. Well, it's been out for a while, and uh, I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready to brace my fears. Like I said, guys, thank you guys for watching. If you guys did enjoy this, leave a like, subscribe to new. Peace out, keep in. As always, stay safe out there, and I'll see you guys in the next one. I, um, feeling something strange. What the fuck is this? I don't remember.